morning and welcome to my Friday. I've just got up, it's quarter past nine in the morning. I've had a really boring week and a lot of it's been preparation for this weekend so I'm glad that most of the prep is done, just a bit more to do and then I can just enjoy it and let events unfold and go with it. Tonight I've got a bit of a different gig. I am gonna go with my boyfriend and play with another band that we don't normally play with. It's not like a normal gig, we're just gonna kind of top up what they're doing if you know what I mean we're gonna play some tune sets now and then and they will accompany us they'll do their normal repertoire and songs and we'll jam along with them maybe some of the time we won't be playing I don't know we might dip in and out so it's a bit different so that's this evening tomorrow we've got a Kaylee but we've got to go in the day to do some setting up for it which is very unusual but I'll go into that in more detail tomorrow Right now, I am gonna just make a start on my normal stuff. Uh, I might have known. She's forgotten her antibiotics. It's okay, because Isabel is actually gonna stay at IB's tonight. And so am I. So I will pack it. Her arm's doing... Well, I think it's doing better. She said she was well enough to go to college. She would forget her head if it wasn't screwed on, honestly. Some people are just like that, aren't they? I don't know what to do. <laughs> I try everything to teach her how to use systems to remember things, but... Uh, She's very resistant to it. One of my systems is just put it by the door if you've got to pack it. Like that. Ugh. Hey, you look at this lot. I got Izzy to start going through her drawers yesterday to clear out some clothes that she's grown out of or won't wear anymore. And she's got quite a few. It's her last day in college today before half term. The final half term of the first year of college. I can't believe it. It seems to have flown by. Wow. Anyway, over this summer, I won't be able to vlog about it really, but I, I need her to sort her room out, you know, de-child it and get it to the way that she will love to be in it because she's still got lots of stuff that she just doesn't need anymore in there from her childhood. I'm sure we've even got plastic animal figures buried at the bottom of boxes and things, just little bits and bobs like that, but there's a lot of them. If I just say sort it out, she doesn't even know where to start, but if I give her one specific task, it seems to work. <laughs> so I'm gonna give her a few more specific tasks over half term. I'd like to get in and help her but she doesn't really want me to. Oh this turned up, I'd ransacked the whole house looking for this, just in the cupboard as he said, just between some baking sheets, I can't believe it, I thought it was gone forever. It's 5 to 12, I'm up and dressed, washed, got my vlog up for Sunday because if I publish it tonight, Friday, there is absolutely no way I'm going to get a vlog filmed and edited and up by Sunday night because I'm just going to be too busy for a few days so that is why I have chosen to do it that way. Anyway I've got a big beaker of squash, I'm going to start with my admin jobs today because they have got to be done today and if I can't fit my flute practice in I'll just have to do a bit before the gig tomorrow at IB's but hopefully I can fit it in. It's 20 to 1 and I'm feeling really on top of things I've got two admin jobs out of the way that that's it I don't need to worry now for quite a while about doing any more of that so brilliant yay I'm gonna go play my flute but I can't film it today because I am going to be playing along with a CD which is copyright. My CD player is so old it's got a cassette deck I can't get the camera in to show you it's got a double cassette deck that's what these buttons are <laughs> I love it I haven't played an actual CD for ages I just play everything on my phone now it's the way it's gone it's about 40 minutes later I have finished practicing my flute <laughs> for today. I have had enough. I went through all the tracks on the CD that I haven't played in years to make sure I could still play them and there was just one that it just needs too much work so I'm just gonna have to say not for this weekend but we've got plenty of other things that we can do in its place so I'm not too worried about that but at least I've got something flagged up for practicing for the next lot coming next week. <laughs> I am going to go and get working on my set list. It's too chunky. I want loads of these. I want it double-sided so I can just flick through it quickly because I found I was flicking through it at the gig and I was just having to turn page after page after page. Look, there's only one thing on there. It just kind of, I did it in a bit of a hurry. Um, yeah, I need to make it all smaller. Do it that layout and I've got some more additions to put in now the things that turned up and at some point I will have lunch during that task I'll like stop have lunch and then get back to it so I'll never get it all done before lunchtime and I'm getting my folder ready for Sunday because on Sunday I've got a rehearsal with my pub band and look at the folder do they know it's Christmas Gaudete you can see the last time I did a gig with this lot oh my word thanks Omicron by the way for that right well we'll take the Christmas stuff out I think and um, leave the other stuff in so I need to pack that because I'm not getting home between now and Sunday night. And I will also need that. Just pop that on the stairs for now, ready to pack. And I will also need that, my wooden tin whistle. So it's not a tin whistle, it's a wooden whistle, but it's like a tin whistle, but it's wood, if you know what I mean. It's a posh one. 
It's 20 past two and I'm just starting to get hungry now. It's funny how it's so different from yesterday. I was just starving all day yesterday from the second I woke up. Today I'm not that bothered. Um, I'm gonna cook imminently though. I'm just gonna shove yesterday's laundry in that basket down there though and get it out of the way so it doesn't take on my cooking smells. I've tidied up the set list that I had already on my computer and I've done some digital decluttering. I've been putting subfolders in subfolders I have, organising all my old tunes, like tune notation. I have this folder called Scores and oh, it was littered. Things were separated by band or project, but within that they were just crazy. So I've made a few extra subfolders. and it makes me feel all happy inside and in control. But what it didn't do is get me any further on what I actually needed to do with it today. But you know, it's all moving forward. I think I've still got time after lunch. I don't have to leave for a few hours. That's better, I've got room to manoeuvre now. I've just been hoovering there as well. There was all bits on the floor. I'm gonna have something a bit different to usual. I'm gonna have some crumpets. With hummus on, because I consulted my list of what's gonna go out of date and needs eaten up, and it was on it, as was the salad. And I'm gonna also have a tin of mushroom soup with it. I think that'll be all right. Mushroom soup is one of those things I really like nutritional yeast flakes with. It's got loads of B vitamins in. It's quite good for veggies and vegans. Gives it that extra yeasty taste. I really think it goes well. Butter and hummus going on the crumpets. Very decadent. Can I do this one handed? <laughs> no, I'm gonna have to put the camera down. <laughs> I'm worried about just like spreading it and it goes straight on the floor, crumpet and all, you know. I'm popping the yeast flakes on at the end after I've heated it up so the cooking doesn't wreck the nutrients, you know. Mm, yummy. It's going to be a very tasty lunch. Very little stir. Oh, I'm in my element here. Why have I set the camera up in front of the mouse? <laughs> I'm pleased to report that TunePal's actually working today, so I sang this thing into it just now, literally with my voice. Because I didn't know what it was called, and it's come up with the Arkansas Traveller, and it's given me the dots, and I can confirm that it is the one. I mean, we don't play it quite like that, but there you go, look, chords and everything. Amazing, isn't it? And you can even play it. There's like a play button. Look at this. You print it straight from your phone. Amazing. I've got another one for it. Nobody ever knows what this one's called. It's in the wrong key for me to sing, so bear with me. Dum dum da da dum ba da 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 dum da da dum da 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 dum ba da 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 dum da 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 da. God, it'll never get that from there. I couldn't reach those bottom notes. Come on in. Ooh ooh, la roulon. Okay, let's see if it's La Roulon. It is! Da, 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 da. Yes, it worked! Da, 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 da. Okay, typed it up, screen captured it. Off you go, La Roulon, into my set list. Yay, there it is! Oh, ha, ha. I really like the way you can just drag PDF files straight out of the folder and into the Word document, just like that. Pew, magic. It's 20 past four. The oven has been on for half an hour or so. Slash puppies. Me and Izzy are gonna try them next week. Distracted a minute, sorry. Right, I'm gonna put a couple of these in. Dinner's gonna be a bit of a rush job tonight. I think these take 28 minutes. One for me. And one for my boyfriend. Twenty-eight minutes. I'm gonna say twenty-five because I can check it before it burns. My plan is to take that with me and eat it on the train because I'm not going to be hungry before it's time to leave. I'm going to get back to my killer set list. Oh, it smells burnt. Oh no. Oh, oh well, could be worse. Epic multitasking fail. Well, mm, yeah. Well, I could try to comfort IB by the fact that I have worked on our set list for us. Uh, while this was taking place. I've actually got to leave in 40 minutes and I'm not getting back for a couple of days so I haven't packed or anything so I need to do that now. I need to wrap up what I was doing up at the desk because I still haven't quite finished. I've just got a couple of little manoeuvres to make and then I'm going to print it off and hopefully it's going to be okay and then I'll be done and I'll get packing and I'm going to put some salad with that, some fruit, crisps, the usual, just make snacky bags. 
and then get going. Good, that's looking so much better. Anyway, I couldn't get it to print double sided. I don't know why. I just, there doesn't seem to be an option. I'm so much happier with that though, but it will be better when it is double sided. Oh, it is double sided. It's just random. Okay. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, I'll just staple it at the top then. Ah, oh, so pleased. Good progress. I have got rather a lot to carry. Not that though, that's charity bag. Rucksack with, you know, all the normal things, flute, etc. Gigging gear, including my transmitter thing that I charged up. Food and drink bag and camera bag. I've made it onto the train. I am so hungry. Just as I was about to leave the house, I had a big low blood sugar wobble. Hands have stopped shaking. I quickly grabbed these and I just had a quick scoff on one of those and a bit of that in the house. But I'm gonna carry on having some now with a pasty. Oh yeah, and some salad. That'd be nice. There's fruit in there as well. Some squash, can of Coke, frazzles, mini cheddar, some of these. This is going to keep us going till like, you know, half 12 at night, I'm thinking. If not longer, all this fruit as well. Satsuma, apple, banana. Shouldn't starve anyway. I'm not going to do any work on the train. I might learn some Spanish, but that doesn't count as work because it's fun and it's relaxing. Uh, so I'm going to have a good old feast and do some Spanish. And I probably won't be able to film much if anything tonight, but we'll see how we go. Let's see. <laughs> IB is picking me up from a rail station and we're going from there. I bet you didn't know IB had a banana holder in his car, did you? Well, learn something new every day. We're on our way to the gig. We're pulled over at the side of the road. It's much later now. We've had a lovely evening, haven't we, darling? Yeah. And I couldn't film it, obviously. Um, we're lost. Ed Sheeran is playing in card, has played. Ed Sheeran has been our competition tonight and uh, all the traffic was coming out of Cardiff and it was horrendous. So IB took a little sneaky back lane, but now we're totally lost. But he's just put the sat nav on, so hopefully all will be well. <laughs> we're not lost, we're simply taking an alternative route. Very alternate. Well, not, we're not that far off, you know. It's gone blurry now. It's 20.20 in the morning and I'm back at my boyfriend's house. Just been up to see Isabel. She's happy, she's had a lovely night out. She got a lift back here. So we've just met her here. I've given her her antibiotics. I had to wake her up <laughs> to give it to her, but she had to have it, so I had to. Uh, anyway, she's leaving early tomorrow morning. We're gonna give her a lift to the train station. I am gonna end the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Could you please give it a thumbs up if you liked it? it helps the child grow, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.